A very special guest in studio with us today. We've been excited to have Parker Barton uh, take time out and uh, come visit with us. Parker, a student at Shelton State, graduated from Hillcrest, a songwriter, guitar player, and a Vine sensation, uh, which is a social media site, went nuts. Good morning, sir. Welcome to the studio. Good morning. How are you, man? I'm doing good. Um, first of all, uh, it's like, wow, that... that <laughs> Your Vine videos have, uh, how many followers have you got now? I'm at like 412,000. 412,000, that's the craziest thing I've ever heard of. So, let me, well you'll probably do better at explaining exactly what the Vine app is. It goes on your phone, it's a social media app. T tell us about that first. Yes sir, uh, basically you just, uh, you turn the camera on yourself and then you hold the thing down with your thumb and make a six second video. That's it. And then that's all it is. Basically. And then your people can follow you and watch your six second video. Yes, sir. And then you can, you know, you can rebind it just like you would retweet something on uh -huh. Twitter. It's just... A it's, repost like you'd repost exactly. something on Facebook. And somehow, in a relatively short period of time, you got up to over 400,000 <laughs> yes, binds because you play music. You're playing uh, songs, which is phenomenal. So well, you were playing baseball for uh, Hillcrest? Or Shelton? Shelton. Shelton. And you said you did your first Vine before a, uh, a ball game. Yes, sir. It was, uh, it, was before, it was during the fall. It was during the fall practice, and uh, Vine had been out for maybe a couple months. Mm, not long. People, not long. And a lot of people had had it, and I was like, well, I might as well. The only reason I even taught myself into uploading it is because I figured out a way to actually upload it rather than holding it down like everyone else. So I uploaded one before practice one day. And left my phone in my car because our coach didn't really like us having our phones yeah, out there. Yeah, yeah. So uh, left my phone in my car and then uh, we went out to practice. And I remember I was in right field and one of the players came up to me and said, Parker, you sing? And I was like, yeah, how do you even know that? He's like, dude, I took my phone to practice and a bunch of people were texting me about you. I was like, what are you talking about? They were like, they're, they're talking about your vibe, man. I'm like, I just posted like an hour ago. He's like, dude, dude, it went viral. And I was like, what does that even mean? Yeah, what so, is going on with this? So, I, you know, after practice, I went out to my car and I looked at my phone. And I was like, holy crap. And I, <laughs> within three hours, I had like 25,000 followers. And I was like, oh my goodness. What man. song did you upload? I did uh, Luke Bryan's uh, Drunk On You. Oh, no kidding. Yep. Wow. For Bryan's. only six seconds. Six seconds. It was just the chorus. It was just a part of the chorus. So. That is yeah. phenomenal. Phenomenal. So afterward, did you say, oh, uh, this is it? Because you've been playing for a while. You, you mentioned yes. uh, uh, before we went on the air that, that music's been a part of your family forever. Obviously, you play guitar yes, sir. and you sing and you write songs. Um, is that always something you wanted to do, was kind of focus on music? Well, it's always been like in my family, like I said. Um, I started off playing the drums, actually. My oh, dad really? bought me a drum set a long time ago, and so I've always been playing the drums. And regardless if my parents liked it or not because right. it was really loud but yeah uh started off on the drums and then you know I, I hit the teens and then like around like 13 or 14 i was like i might try to pick up the piano so you know i taught myself how to play the piano by like ripping up sticky notes and putting them on the keys sure so you know then i went to the piano and my brother and dad had always played guitar and i was like man it would be so much easier to carry around like guitar rather than a piano or a drum set so i kind of like worked my way to teach myself how to play the guitar too and i was like okay so Ever since then, I mean, I always, it's always been something I've wanted to do, but it never really became, you know, a possibility until Vine came along, I guess. So. And now, is it just Vine, or are you moving along to, like, I mean, you know, people do videos on YouTube and, and things like that. Do you have any full songs? I have two full songs on YouTube and one uh, Vine compilation, which is, I just have all of my Vines into one big video, and it was, I think it was almost a year, a year's worth, but it was like 40-something videos of Vine. But I have two full ones on there, uh, Kiss Tomorrow Goodbye by Luke Bryan and Drunk On You, the one that, mm -hmm. you know, got it all started for me. But other than Vine and YouTube, I do Instagram, which I have like 66,000 followers on Instagram, and uh, Twitter, I have like 28,000 right now. So. Mm -hmm. Real quick, what is your Vine handle? Uh, at Parker Barton. At Parker Barton, B-A-R-T-O-N. Yes, sir. Just like that. So what are your plans? Are, are, uh, obviously, uh, you're passionate about music. You mentioned you've been writing some songs and stuff. Where do you want to go? What do you want to do? I mean, I want to, I want to make it, obviously. I, mean, yeah. I, I, I definitely want to do this for the rest of my life. So, I mean, because of Vine, I've gotten to meet a bunch of, you know, very special people who are already in it. And I've been fortunate enough to, like, be friends with them. And I talk to them on a regular basis now. So. And you get to write with some cool people. I get to write with some cool people. So, um, working up to, you know, maybe going to Nashville and writing with some people. Uh, Tyler Ward, who's a huge YouTube sensation, mm -hmm. uh, might go ride with him. Uh, 
the band Dan and Shay. I'm really good friends with Shay and his sister Gabby. So that's why. Probably get right with that at some point in time. So you know what? I bet you at this point, because it's been just over, a, it's not even been quite a year uh, yeah. since the Vine thing kicked off. Uh, the encouragement of somebody uh, up and coming, because things are a lot different than it used to be. Go to Nashville, stand on a corner with your guitar, exactly. and hope you can actually showcase your talents. You know, on social media, and you've been obviously well received. If you don't mind, I'm going to get you to do uh, a little bit of a song. Sounds good to me. All right, man. We'll we'll uh, hear from Parker Barton. Um, from right here in Tuscaloosa. Congratulations, man, on, uh, on this crazy ride you've been on so far. We appreciate you coming in. Thank you so much.